Here we are at Sydney Caravan Camp Show again, and I've uh, managed to finally rope in the managing director of Guys, Wayne Moller, a busy man, but we finally got hold of him. Wayne, welcome. Paid up, how you going? Good. Um, the, the Sydney show is a, a great show for, for everyone to, in the local area to look at, but it's um, one of the biggest shows on, on the whole calendar, isn't it? Yeah, it's a, it's a good opportunity for us to showcase our product to like the largest market uh, being the Sydney area. You know? Yeah. Um, and uh, having uh, the, the Gosford dealer here, and um, and then we're looking at uh, in, in Melbourne shortly, coming into Melbourne, you've know, got the, the Melbourne dealer there. There's a fair bit of input from, from all those dealers as well, isn't there? Yeah, it takes, it takes a lot to set up the shows. You know, we spend, um, you know, probably four or five days before the show and a couple afterwards. Some of our guys are away from home for, you know, two or three weeks at a time. Yeah, and, and this, this part of the year, it's just full on. I, I know what it's like. I've experienced it myself. But um, in part of the show and the setup, yeah, the, the, obviously there's a big financial commitment and everything like that. Um, are we getting a, a lot of people coming along to the shows and actually uh, turning around and saying, yep, yeah, I'm going to buy a guy next week and things like that? Has that actually happened? Um, it, it does happen, but um, mostly, you know, we try to spend a lot of time with the customer and explain the product to them. We actually sell more caravans and, and product by people actually coming into the yard, tow testing, you know, getting the whole guys to experience. Yeah, well, that's a big thing. I suppose the tow test, everyone uh, doesn't get the opportunity often to, to tow test a, a caravan, but a guys, that's that's nearly part of the thing we do all the time, in Gosford at least. Oh, I think so. I mean, it's a very important part. You know, you spend a lot of time on the road and, and safety is important and you really need to have a, a caravan behind you that, um, that that's safe on the road. Yeah. Having a big group, we've just, we've just been talking to Justin earlier, um, uh, involved and Trevor and whatnot. Um, having that, as a managing director, overseeing all that that commitment um, by those guys as well. Um, are you finding that the the guys' product is really getting out into the marketplace more and more by by um, by the advertising that Justin's pu pushing out there through the caravan motorhome and, and other avenues and, and Trevor is by you know he's heavily behind the MyPod uh, design things like that. Yeah, I think mainly our goal has been not to um, you know not to sell thousands of caravans, but put out a product that people recognise as a as a quality brand and, and you know quality service from our dealers. Yeah. That's really what we've tried to, to get across um, in the marketplace, and I think it's. It's starting to work. It's been difficult, you know. We're five years down the track from from when we started, and I think we've, you know, we're established in the pl in the marketplace now, and, and it's starting to move forward. Yeah, I, and like you're saying, it's, it's a, quite a few years in. Um, are, are we looking at anything um, pretty fancy coming up the next couple of years, or you know? Oh, there'll be a, a few more things coming out in the next couple of years. Um, we're not really um, haven't really decided what we're doing for next year yet. That won't happen until August when I go over to Germany for the for the caravan show. We sit down, we look at what's available for next year's product, and and see what we want to use in our caravans in Australia and what people in this country might like. We're in the six thirty XK six thirty, one of the one of the most uh, popular models. Um, are we finding that, that layouts like that will stay in the Australian market? I think so. I mean, uh, a, a big part of our market is, you know, the island bed, and, and I think a signature of the Geist product is, is the club lounge that we're sitting in now, and mm. that's something that we've become recognised for in the marketplace, and that's something that we'll try and continue with in, in any models that we bring in in the future. Okay. Um, thanks for talking to us, Wayne. I know it's hard to get you away, and I'll let you get away back to um, all the work you've got there. Um, uh, everyone, it, it's, if you get a chance to uh, say good day to Wayne and, and, and around, he's a busy man. Unfortunately, I don't think he's going to be in Melbourne, eh? But um, no. but we'll uh, we'll catch up with him, but dare say in Brisbane. Um, but yeah, feel free to um, to contact uh, geistdirect.com.au, uh, and I'll uh, put any questions through to Wayne that I possibly can for you. See you then.